Oh. Is this where he, is this where Renner went? Oh yeah. There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. Never doubt me. And here's the combination for the there's a, a padlock chest in the attic upstairs. Twenty-nine, eighteen, fifty-four. Uh, cool. She made a lot of... What should I call these? Slides? They're, they're not videos. Um, silent memories? Silent memories. The long... The forgotten Silent Hill game. Find anything useful? Not yet. But you know, the night is young. So, it's Nona's birthday in three days. Really? Awesome. Yeah, that, that's great. That's great. I can, um, I can really use that. I feel like... It's like I'm behind enemy lines with that one. This is perfect. Just be nice is what I'm trying to say. Say happy birthday, you know? Normal human stuff. Oh, yeah, no, of course. Got it. I'll turn up the nice, turn down the charm. Don't worry. Thanks. All right, gave him a little bit of a push, but hey, we got our codes. We got the code for the chest upstairs, so we can head upstairs and figure out, I don't know, some element of this woman's crazy secret she was keeping to herself. This game's simultaneously making me think of life is strange. Everybody's gone to the Rapture and Firewatch for a variety of reasons. Are you, um, doing okay? <sighs> yeah, I'm alright. Yeah? We're going home soon, so... Yeah, that's true. Cause you got the woman with the weird secret about what's going on thing from everybody's gone to the Rapture. The actual tower and a few elements from Firewatch of story bits and then obviously Life is strange, blue-haired girl with time travel going on. 29, 18, 54. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. What do you think that means? She couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. They didn't give us a ton to work with. Oh, am I waiting for him to come up here? Is this... Ah, the boat keys. Got him. Perfecto. Boat's not gonna work. <laughs> All right, we got keys for the boat. There's no way this works out. I got the keys. They were in the attic upstairs. In a chest, but who cares? Let's just go. Go, 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 before... Oh, there it goes. Alex! Oh, Alex! Come down here, please! We have something we want to show you! <laughs> Clarissa, what's going on? You're confused, aren't you? Well, you should be. How does it go? Things are different, except in a different way? <laughs> Just come downstairs so we can get started. Nona, come on, honey, it's time to motor. Is everyone dead right now? It's not a good sign. Come on, Ren, are you asleep? Nope. This thing's really fixated on Clarissa, isn't it? I wonder if it's going back and forth between the two of us, like in some way... I seem to be involved a lot because of the way that I keep jumping in time and no one remembers it, but... She's the one that spends the most time being possessed. Maybe she's the most vulnerable to all this. I'm sure this mirror is going to give me a clue as I walk by it. No? The mirror's been taunting me. Come on, Jonas! Up and at him! Nope. Yep, this is what Doomed feels like. Is she going to be over here? Ah, there you are. Now we imagine you're a bit confused. But don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Training? I, I don't want to be trained. What are you, you signed up for this, Alexandra? Alexandra? In the caverns, you tuned in to our signal. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. You walked in here with clear- Sorry, okay? How many times do you want me to tell you I'm sorry? I didn't know what would happen. You have nothing to apologize for. Trust us on that. 
The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house. You will go and find it. See? As simple and good humored as your mother's apple pie. What is it with you guys and all the, the games? You're like dogs or children. Just what is the point? The point, dear. The point is that they were never games. And you can figure that out by your lonesome. Now, let's start with the softball. I spy, with my little eye, radiation. There is, of course, a time limit here. So, ten. Radiation? Shit. Yeah, television. Is it... are you talking about the TV? Very good. Well done. The older models admitted x-rays. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation. In another sense. Pay attention. What are you even talking about? I spy with my little eye a notch. Oh, God. Why? Oh, God. Controls. Controls. Alexandra, what a disappointment you turned out to be. Don't. Just. Just stop, please. Don't do anything to him. Oh, your new brother. Gone to first light. Bring him back. Right now. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. What's done is done, as they say. It's time for the bonus round, Alex, so stay quick. This is what you really want to find. I spy with my little eye a picture of a memory. Be fast. Uh, the picture of... of... I guess it's Maggie, Adler, and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Emma. See, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing... Well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Emma tried to... Sport with us many years ago and... Well, only one survived. But in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time. Wait, what? What happened to Anna? Let's leave it at the poor girl didn't know what she was playing with. It doesn't matter. They're not an eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use our waves to absorb into your friends so as sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. You, you can't do that. Think about what you're doing. We can do that, Alex, and what it seems to your parents as 80 years has been for us eons to know an existence without life. We tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. We had to keep you here, on the island. It will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. And on to the next. You... You had your time. You had your time. Don't take ours just because you had some... some accident. We never had our time. It was ripped from us. We watched the universe's conception fly to its demise over and over and over again. When our vessel crashed on the rocks, we had until dawn. And so are you. We would spend our time wisely. And... We thank you for your good service. So... I'm kind of screwed. So we absolutely have some kind of ghost or alien that's trying to take over our bodies. I'm totally on the right track there. And... Stepbrother's back, I guess? I thought I, I thought he actually died. What kind of mess are we in right now? I think you have to do a specific timing with these things. Like, you have to be... Rotating at a certain rate, because if you go slow, it doesn't work, but if you go too fast, you can break it, too. That said, I think I think they all kind of follow the same basic speed, so it's kind of... It's not much of a puzzle at that point. I, like, I don't think you have to solve it. There's Wanderbot again. Tell Michael he should go out on his own. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. <sighs> what a weird mess. So we can go on. <laughs> I, I think I'm gonna be sick. 
Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Ugh. Ah, no. But I wish it was a dream. Usually there's a lot more talking horses. Oh, and by the way, next time, put some actual effort into the game, pretty please. It felt like someone was shoving spiders down my throat. She, uh, tried, kinda. It was much harder than it looked, trust me. So, I mean, Christ, if Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then... I mean, the plan has to be to retrieve her, right? I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost is a monster, so... Clarissa is only, like, one slice of the problem. We're all infected or whatever, so we need to rip the issue off like a bandage all at once. Okay, great, yeah, but how do we do that? Well, uh, good question. Maggie, I think Maggie Adler might have had some sort of a plan or a, a scheme or something to fix what's going on. What possible plan could Maggie Adler have? First of all, she's dead. And second of all, she was like the island Mother Goose. She didn't know she any- She knew something. I mean, look around. This whole house is like a ghost hunting command center. And she thought she needed to tune a radio into the, the source of the problem in the cave. Well, if we're going to the cave... Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right, I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. What kind of name is a Fippany Fields, anyway? Wait, is it a Fippany? It's, uh... It's Epiphany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. We still can't find Clarissa. And so, although she has been doing a lot of explaining it all so far. So we're all infected. It's slowly trying to take over all of our minds so they can live through us and probably replace us as, as a result. And we're all breaking. So it is trying to become familiar with us. That's why it's going through my memories. Be careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh man, if this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos. Yeah. I'm sure this is just the, uh... God, it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will you? Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave. Just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But won't it be, like, locked or something, right? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's, that's going a little above, above and beyond. Well, how would she even know this? I don't care how much research she did, this would be out of anyone's realm of expertise. Well, something better work, or... Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, sorry, this is like... This looks like the end, but from the... From the wrong film thing. No, 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 wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing, because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See? It says, when someone sends an emergency signal from the Capard station in the woods, and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. All right, but come on, Nona, do you honestly believe that the old equipment in either building will still work? It's, I don't know, but it's the only thing we have so far. And time's a-clickin'. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Wait, wait, I, um, I'm sorry, I kind of zoned out there for a second. What are we doing? Ren and Nona are Team um, Soaring Eagle, and you and I are Awesome Squad. Uh, I want that one. And we're splitting up to work on some old fangled machinery to open the bomb shelter, to get into the cave, to yada yada yada, save our lives or whatever.
So we need to use the station I found earlier to open the bomb shelter. Alright, we're on the right track. That is far away, though. Ah, uh, no, we're, we're right next to Epiphany Fields. That's that's the connecting tissue to do all this, so we just need to go through the uh, woods again. Alright, break. And if anything goes wrong, please, don't tell me, I won't want to know. Well, now I'm gonna run over there and specifically tell you at the first drop of bad news. No. We barely have a plan. They're talking about going into the cave and tuning to the frequency. How do you know that doesn't make everything worse? Then you talk about stuff like going through the portal, like going to the other side and tuning it from there. That sounds like a that sounds like someone sacrificing themselves, right? Because if you close whatever is happening here, won't you be stuck on the other side? I think that we might not all make it out of this. I don't know if it'll be a specific choice or a dynamic of all the different character relationships or what, but... Someone might not make it out of here. That's how you get to the beach. That is definitely not the right path. Because the only... That path to the, uh... Yeah, that path to the cave is, is uh, caved in at this point, so there's not much purpose to go there, aside from... Maybe if I want to try to hunt down the antique store. Are you coming, Jonah? Oh, I walked past the prompt for clicking on it. <laughs> okay, so we're supposed to go figure out how to make these stations talk to each other and see if they'll work so that we can open up the vault. But I also kind of just want to go visit that uh, antique store, honestly. I'm curious. Uh-oh. Alex. Alex, okay, are you... Are you back to normal? Look, I think... I'm sorry, but... I think Ren might be in trouble. Why? I just saw... It, it, it was like a premonition, I think? And, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because... I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all... red-eyed, like... when we get possessed. I... did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider than. But the thing with Ren, it was so real. It was like it, I was there with him. Maybe we should go back. But I'm sure he's fine, so let's finish what we started. He's got a good point. It might be them opening a door to me. It might be them trying to basically create a distracting vision that makes me think, Oh no, we can't do this task right now, we gotta go back so we can do the other thing instead. It's, that's, that's how you stop somebody from stopping you, basically. I think I'm gonna take a quick detour down to Main Street, though. Just to try to find the antique store. I just wanna see if, if I stop by there, if my, uh... If we'll find one of those caches, cause the, uh... Yeah, the number station, they were just, they were, she was spelling antique. There was an antique store down there, right? There's a letter down here. I didn't know Maggie grew up in Maine. There's a similar statue of a soldier in Maine where I, where I grew up. My memory of it is, I think, part of the reason why I said yes when the army recruited me out of college, despite my family's protestations. Anna, my closest friend from childhood, was of course thrilled at the possibility of my escape. I anonymously started the petition in 1975 to have this one this one made after the daughter of Kanaloa crewman Francis Salter asked. I don't know why, a marker maybe, for the hope I once had to help people. There's just a letter on the ground on the way there. I'm just I'm just trying to head towards the antique store right now. I was wondering when those were going to come into play cuz they were it seemed like there was a bunch of them. Maybe they didn't show up anywhere until just when I Oh yeah, maybe there's maybe there's uh, letters on the ground all over the map now that I've found the first hint of one at her house. Oh, there's another one. That woman Marianne Bozek helped her transcribe the ghost's transmissions. Marianne Bozek, forever engraved on the Command Annex's memorial plaque, was a kind, humble woman who helped me decode the ghost's unusual messages. I don't think she ever really believed my hypothesis that they were relays from the sunken submarine, but though she corresponded with, as she put it, a man named Calvin, an electrician who died on the Kanaloa, I pieced together the truth. 
the, co the cover-up and my own tragic mistake that killed him and his mates over months of careful deciphering. Can't help but wonder why there's these letters all over the floor around here, but also kind of wondering why they're showing up on the ground right along the path I'm trying to take. Here we go, we're coming back up on the antique store from the beginning, the one that we were talking about being closed early on. There's something. Oh my god, the, the Camaloa was destroyed by friendly fire? We, we've been lied to all this time. The USS Walter Roy, a destroyer escort, sunk the USS Kanaloa with friendly fire on October 25th, 1943. It had held a de developmental nuclear reactor in its belly. It had been sent out weeks earlier as a test of its capabilities. Relatively few even knew of its existence, which tripled the base's confusion when the submarine's communications had been cut. No one outside of a handful of us would ever know of the truth. I would discover later that a weapons te uh, technician of the Walter Roy had been at Francis Salter's wedding. Salter was an engineer on Kanaloa. I don't know why, but it's strange to me. That can't be the drop-off, though, is it? Is there something else around here? Or, or, or are the transmissions just telling me where the next letter is? Let's find out. Discovery of intercept message by Lighthouse. Date and catalog, 1968. Concerned report of indeterminate origin detailing naval communications. Brother's name also mentioned. remind myself 140.1 yeah I'm getting a whole lot of nothing right now 